The Hot Spring County Jail bursting at the seams as it reaches full capacity. The sheriff also says the department has made many felony arrests and more than 500 traffic stops this year alone. Good evening, everyone. Glad you're with us for Fox 16 News at 6.30. I'm Donna Terrell. I'm Kevin Kelly. Tylisa Hampton has more on how the county is trying to handle the overcrowding problem and has reaction from those living in the community. Josh Casso wasn't shocked to learn the Hot Spring County Jail is full. It doesn't surprise me. It is kind of a smaller jail. Sheriff Scott Finkbeiner says the jail only holds one fifth of their population. We're going to have to release people sometimes that we don't want to release. Uh, that stolen property and things like that. Seeing the crime shift. We have conducted around 600 traffic stops. Finkbiner says they're at capacity with 55 inmates being housed, releasing some to make room for violent criminals. We have child molesters, we have, you know, murderers in the jail. Um, you obviously can't release them. The decision on who gets released depends on a certain criteria and approved by department officials. We can't really hold misdemeanors, at least for very long, because uh, we have violent felons. Finkbeiner says they managed to move 15 inmates to other county jails, but it was difficult. I'd say most jails in the state of Arkansas are at capacity. Finkbeiner says they're trying to get a larger jail along with more resources. We have ordered radar units um, for our vehicles. We've ordered uh, some tasers, some newer tasers that are better. Um, we're also in the process of uh, taking, doing bids for body cams. Cassaw works and lives down the street from the county jail. He believes everyone deserves a second chance. As long as they're not out causing issues, I mean, I don't see the problem with it.